But so we're here. We got here at 4.30 and then we were only able to get in at 6 a.m. Yeah, 6. Right now, 6. Yes, we had to wait for the approval from SDN Tourism. Yeah, make sure you have that. Yeah, make sure you wait if you don't want extra... If you don't want extra stress mm. before you fly. So if you guys want to go, you need to do a few things before mm -hmm. you go. Um, so we'll guide you through yeah. this video and some other thing a video na may nandun may mga recommendations sa pwede nyo puntahan. Mm -hmm. So based on the tourist requirements, this is as of September 2021. I'm going to be reading off my phone. Mm -hmm. This was provided to us by the accommodation that we chose, which is Arca mm -hmm. Hayahai. Hi! Surf and beach resort mm -hmm. yeah that's like their full name but arca hi 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 they're all nice yeah and the dogs mm -hmm. they have a the lot dogs. of dogs and they have really good food we're <laughs> yeah. getting sidetracked again because <laughs> the food is good the hummus super hummus super, mondays super. i wish every day was monday yeah, that's my favorite yeah so jumping back to the requirements first one is negative rt pcr test or rt pcs saliva test mm -hmm. within 48 hours of your flight Then after that, uh, the next one is uh, you have to have a confirmed three days, two nights booking at an accredited resort, a DOT accredited resort. So if you check on Google, I think they'll give you a big list of even so resorts Facebook, you can choose. Yeah, naman, uh, and Facebook. Lumalabas, kung ano yung mga list. And just to make sure, kapag may gusto kayo i-book, yeah, ask just, yeah, muna. just give them a call or message yeah. them or whatever. Ask them first before booking. Yeah, para hindi sa mm -hmm. And then. So Arca AI is um, DOT accredited, which we asked them beforehand, and yeah, they said that we can just book them and then that's it, they'll help us with all the requirements. So the next one is a valid ID with address, so any government issued ID will do. Just, mm -hmm. I don't think you need to give two, just one. We only give one each. So that's, yeah. Then the next one is a round trip ticket, so you're like going to Shargao and going back to Manila. Yeah, pero optional yung um yung pabalik. Yeah. Kasi meron din mga tourists na nagsistay sila longer. Yeah, like an open-ended ticket. Mm -hmm. But basically, I guess you're... Yeah, trapped. but for us, nag-book na rin kami. Kaya, yeah. yun na rin yung pinasa na ng requirements. And then, number six is, uh, this one is an optional requirement. Travel itinerary in Shargao Island. So we asked the accommodation if we needed to provide this because we didn't have a fixed itinerary we just had a bunch of lists that we wanted to check out and they said you don't need to do it so yes. we didn't send that and then the next one signed e-health form which is uh they give you a link so you just need to follow the instructions on the link that they give you and you'll get the e-health form and once you complete all of the requirements um, you need to email it to sdntourism at mm -hmm. gmail.com and copy the, the resort that you're booking or the accredited resort. Or make sure na tapos na kayo with the RT-PCR kasi hindi yeah. nila accept yung um, um, submission ninyo if kulang-kulang yung, yeah. yung requirements. So you just gather all the requirements and then your last one will be But make sure to wait for their um, reply. reply. Like if in a day, hindi sila nag reply, yeah, just, just keep, send them keep a sending message. them the email, just forward it and forward it. Kasi yeah, so what happened to us is, nasa yeah. airport, airport na kami. kami, as in, parang You'll dumating see it kami. In the next <laughs> dumating kami by 4, 6, p 6 a.m. na. Yeah, no, I think no. we were there earlier pa. 5 yata, we were there na. 4.30. 4 30, mm. yeah, that was really early, so we were there like, yeah, okay, mm. we got it. So, I'm bilis lang, dal wala na sa the Through the thing, we're okay, and then we're like, okay, time to go to get our, uh, what do you call it? Uh, where's the back. email? Yeah, nasan daw po yung email. And then they said, oh, where's the email yeah. from SDN Tourism? And we were like, I sabi ko ba sa kanya, I told you, we need that. And I said, uh, they didn't email, so we yeah. just kept emailing them. I was emailing them like 
30 minutes, I just kept mm -hmm. sending the same email. And then they send you a reply and they say approved. approved. And your, your name. And your your names. And then you show it. And then yung um, yeah, accept sa yeah. Um, airport. Yeah, they'll give you a new Without boarding that, pass. Without that, hindi kayo makaka You can't leave. Mm -hmm. You can't leave. Oh, Speaking of acceptance na. letter, the accommodation will help you mm -hmm. secure that. If they are accredited. So yeah. make sure you're not accredited. So basically, yeah. you just send they'll they'll ask you for a list of requirements mm -hmm. uh let me go so yung ginawa namin kasi it. um parang uh, weeks weeks before kami pumunta sa Siargao nagbook kami ng um hotel yeah. and yun binook namin sila na yung nag-asikaso so you have to coordinate with them send your requirements to them and mag email naman sila mag email back sila ng mm -hmm. mga kailangan yung gawin and then after that uh, mula na kayong kailangan gawin pagkatapos ng RT-PCR nyo send the email to SDN. sdntourism at gmail mm, kapag com. kumpleto na doon, so, wag yeah. nyong imimix up yung uh, letter of acceptance, yung letter of acceptance yeah, as, sa, kasi yun yung akala approval. namin yeah, iba pa yung thought. approval, iba pa yung letter of acceptance na inasikaso ng hotel ninyo para sa inyo mm -hmm. so the hotel will help you with the um letter of acceptance so basically they just uh, for what was asked for us they just asked us a copy of our valid ids mm -hmm. and then they said um you settle your payment and then they emailed the, the uh, booking confirmation and the process that you need to follow based on the lgu's um, requirements for the day so the last step after you email that you need to download the trace app if you haven't already Para hindi na hassle yeah. pagdating ninyo dun. Kasi pagdating you gotta, sa... You gotta scan the QR yeah, code. Yeah, pagdating nyo sa airport yun, may mga isa scan kayo. Mm -hmm. and Using the trees. Kailangan nun. Yeah. Para hindi lang matagalan kayo sa airport kung gusto nyo mapabilis yung life nyo. Tapos, kailangan nyo rin ng cash. Yeah. Kasi pagdating nyo dun, may mayroon ka environmental fee. Yeah, which is 20 pesos, uh, 20 pesos each. But actually, that's it. Mm -hmm. um, and it's up to you if you're going to book uh, airport transfer with your accommodation. Pero Ours, we suggest we, yeah, we yeah. suggest you do because it's kind of hard. I don't know if you and can flag down. And the booking is um, 300, it, yeah, 300 per, per head. head. That's one way. Yeah, from from airport the airport to, to Arca. Arca. The new additional requirement that we had, which is stated on your letter of acceptance, so it's not a surprise. Mm -hmm. Bago lang daw yung it's a new nila. requirement. Mm -hmm. So on your fifth day, you need to get an antigen test. Um, message yeah. Well, our accommodation was mm -mm. kind enough to remind us. Yeah, they remind kami ng lunch. So then afternoon, um, nagana na kami na Yeah, na kami. because um, when I mess when they message actually, I asked them, uh, what was the process? Do we mm -hmm. need to go somewhere? Is there a clinic that we need to go to? And they said, um, we can have the swabber come to you, which is Star really days. convenient because. Mm -hmm. I mean, we're not from there, so we didn't know if we had to go somewhere. So we paid 1,700 1, per, per head. Ulitin lang namin yung mga requirements first. Uh, negative RT-PCR test mm -hmm. or RT-PCS saliva test within mm -hmm. 48 hours of your flight. And then you need the confirmed booking, three days, two nights at a DOT accredited hotel or Which resort or hostel or whatever, accommodation. Mm -hmm. And then three, send your accommodation or prepare a valid ID with your address, your stated address. And then you need the acceptance letter. So the acceptance letter is the one that the hotel will help you secure from the local government. So that's what you need and that's where it states the requirement for the antigen. And then your round trip ticket and then your travel itinerary, which is optional. If you have it, you can send it. But our, our accommodation said we didn't really need mm -hmm. to give. And then your signed e-health form, which is uh, just following instructions on the link provided. And then once that's done, compile all your requirements, screenshot it, print screen it. So mga natitirang yeah, oras ninyo or ba yung flight ninyo. Yeah, and then send it send to it to SDN. them and wait for their reply. Make mm -hmm. sure to wait for their reply. If wala pa ring reply, just send the message. Yeah, just keep emailing it oras pa and yan. emailing yeah. it. Because they said they checked. 20, was it 24-7? 24-7. Kasi yung nag-message kami around 4.30 to 6 a.m. Yeah, they eventually -reply replied. Nag-reply din naman Then the last one is download the Trace app. Mm -hmm. That's it. And on your fifth day, prepare. Prepare money for the, the antigen. antigen test. So yeah, that's it. 
So if you guys have any questions or clarifications or other concerns and stuff, just leave a comment down below. And we will try to tackle that as best mm -hmm. as we can. So yeah. And if you want to book Arca, yeah, I would really recommend Arca. Sobrang sarap ng food, sobrang bait ng mga tao, even the owners. And the dogs. And the dogs. That's it. Thanks guys. Safe See travels. See you in our next vlog. See you in our next view.